some science, brilliant scientist discovered. It scaled incredibly, like AI does, and it made its way relatively quickly into every, many things that we use. Um, your computer, your phone, that camera, the light, whatever. And it was, a, it was a real unlock for the tech tree of humanity. And there were a period in time where probably everybody was really obsessed with the transistor companies, the semiconductors of you know, Silicon Valley back when it was Silicon Valley. But now, you can maybe name a couple of companies that are transistor companies, but mostly you don't think about it. Mostly it's just seeped everywhere. And Silicon Valley is, you know, like probably someone graduating from college barely remembers why it was called that in the first place. And you don't think that it was those transistor companies that shaped society, even though they did something important. You think about what Apple did with the iPhone, and then you think about what TikTok built on top of the iPhone. I think that's what will happen with AI. Like, okay, you know, kids born today, they, they never knew the world without AI. So they don't really think about it. It's just this thing that's going to be there in everything. And, and they will think about, like, the companies that built on it and what they did with it and the kind of, like, political leaders. And, you know, the role of the AI companies is all these companies and people and institutions before us built up the scaffolding. We added our one layer on top, and now people get to stay on top of that, and then one layer, and the next, and the next, and many more things. And that is the beauty of our society. We kind of all... I, I'm, I love this like idea that society is the super intelligence. Like, no one person could do on their own what they're able to do with all of the really hard work that society has done together to like give you this amazing set of tools. AI Metaverse. 구독해 주세요.